Hey there! We will be explaining one of the most confused topic in international trade. We will do it in a crystal clear way. To be able to explain, we need three must-haves and one good to have. Buyer, seller and product are essentials to explain the topic. Also, we appreciate if you can like the video and subscribe. This is good to have for us. Here we go, case by case. 1. Xworks Xworks means the seller just gets the toy ready at their place. Seller prepares the product, buyer must pick it up and arrange everything else. 2. Free Carrier FCA The seller takes the toy to a chosen spot, let's say a London Playstow bus station. From there, the buyer takes over. 3. Carriage Paid To CPT means the seller pays to send the toy to a city like Paris. But once it's en route, the buyer looks after it and covers risk during delivery. 4. Carriage and insurance paid. CIP is when the seller pays for the journey and insures the toy until it reaches a place like Berlin. So seller pays, transport and insurance, buyer takes over at destination. 5. Delivered at terminal. In DAT Incoterm, the seller sends the toy to a specific spot, like Tokyo Port, Terminal A. Once there, the buyer is in charge to handle import and take over. 6. Delivered at place. DAP is when the seller gets the toy all the way to a place, for example, a Mumbai warehouse. It's the buyer's job from there to import and take over. 7. Delivered duty paid. DDP is like a full service delivery. The seller gets the toy to a Sydney store, pays all fees including import fees, and the buyer just collects it. 8. Free alongside ship. For FAS, the seller places the toy next to the vessel in a port. The buyer then loads and ships it. 9. Free on board FOB. The seller ensures the toys safely on a ship in Shanghai. Then, the buyer sails it and ensures the cargo if needed. 10. Cost and freight. For CFR, the seller covers all costs until the toy's sea journey ends in a destination. In this incoterm, insurance should be made by the buyer if needed. When cargo arrives in destination, buyer imports and take over. 11. Cost, insurance and freight. In CIF case, the seller pays for the trip and insures the toy until it reaches a port, buyer imports and take over a destination. One important tip in the end, please always call Incoterms with locations. Incoterm defines responsibility sharing however it is always needed to have a place to define where this responsibilities change part. For example, CIF Singapore, CIP Detroit and so. Also, we are sharing a responsibility chart based on Incoterms 2020 in the description.